Hello friends and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda. This is Mike A10. So we have just entered level 6. Um, this one's going to be a doozy. This is a, this is a tough one. I think it's the most difficult level of the game. Let's meet the new enemies. These guys are the ones that make it tough. Uh, these wizard guys, I, I the actual name of them escapes me at the moment, I'm sorry. Um, they come in two forms. The yellow reddish one, which is in this room. And then there's the more dangerous blue version, which we'll unfortunately encounter soon enough. Um, this is actually going to be made worse by the fact I'm playing it on an emulator. Um, I'll explain in a moment. Um, this man gives us a clue to th the boss. Aim at the eyes of Goma. So we will find out what that means when we face Goma. And if you are familiar with other Zelda games, then you are also familiar with Goma, most likely. So, um... The wizard foes that we encounter here... So these guys stay stationary in one place and then shoot at you. They, uh, When they appear, they're aiming at the spot where you're standing at, so that's why you always want to move right away when you see them appear. Otherwise, it's easy to just go and kill them then. The blue ones move around, and then they hover and they can pass through uh, like the rocks, the blocks in the middle of the room. They can do that. Um, so they're much more difficult to hit, and they also just... They're smart. They just go right at where you are and, and bump into you and hurt you, so... They are quite annoying. So, do not come to this uh, level without a red medicine to use. Or you'll be sorry! There's a key that can come in useful. Okay, so the next room is where we're gonna encounter blue ones as well as yellow ones. So I need some fancy footwork. Oh crap, no. Okay, so remember I told you about those guys? They can... Those guys that look like a big mud pie walking around, they can steal your big shield. And that's exactly what they did if they clamp onto you like that. So I'm gonna end up having to buy myself another shield. And I'm going to start using bombs against these guys. Now what the, the issue with playing this on the emulator is that when these guys float around uh, on the emulator they're actually disappearing so I'm not seeing right away where they're going. Um, which is making this more difficult of an experience. Okay, there I got him. So I guess I wasn't too bad. I didn't lose too much life. Lost my shield though. Let's move on. Okay, uh, I'm just going to pass through this room because I really don't want to deal with those guys and the reward of defeating them in that room is not that great. Um, here's a three-headed Gliok. You remember Gliok was the uh, boss of level four. He only had two heads there. He's a mini boss here and he's stronger with three heads. And as we already know, when you kill a head, it starts floating around shooting stuff at you and being a nuisance. And because I'm not f full on health, I can't shoot from a distance, so... Gotta get in close. So yeah, these wizard guys... The... Well, not these, but the wizard guys of this level. I do not like them. Luckily though, we have the map now. So we want to go up into this room here, and we're going to have to face some of these guys. Because we want to get something in this room. 
utilizing my bombs against these guys, because... Oh, they even go in the doorways like that, so you can't really sit in the doorway. Okay, that's time for medicine. Yeah. I'm a little rusty, but these guys are definitely a pain, even if you're up on your game. Alright. It's much easier when you have the ability to shoot your sword out. Okay, so the treasure for this level is a magic wand. To demonstrate, I have to select, select it first. Uh, to demonstrate like that. It's not super powerful attack strength, but you do actually power it up a little bit later in the game with another item, so. No more on that for now. We'll come to that when we get there. Okay, got the key there. I'm just gonna go, go through. Um, kill these guys. Um, anything special? No, actually this, there was nothing special in this room, so... I shouldn't even have come in here, but I did anyway. Oh, that wasn't fair at all. Alright. No, no reward for killing everybody there either. Now you hear the boss, but we're not actually at the boss yet. Oh, leave me alone, please. See where he was going. Yeah, when I uh, when I was younger, playing this 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 level was so annoying. There are secrets where fairies don't live. Well, thank you, sir. That's actually a hint as to where the next level, level seven, is located on the world map. I won't say any more on that either, for now. And let's go down this way now. I'm gonna take this key and run. Utilize the old. Yes, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, all right, all right. Um. Okay, so I know that there's gonna be more wizards in the next room. Um, I'm probably gonna end up, unfortunately, having to use. That medicine. Um, I might even have to make a second run coming back if I die or don't have enough medicine replenishment. Um, all right. Let me equip the bombs, and uh, I'm gonna actually end the video here. And when we come back, I will uh, hopefully be able to complete this level without having to get killed and come back again. So um, stay with me and uh, we'll be right back. Thanks for watching.